Hi. So today I'm making a video in support of the shoulders. This is an area where we hold a lot of tension, you know, all the weight of the world on our shoulders. So this area needs to be supported more than probably other areas of your body. So the way that we're going to do that is we're going to work with the energy of the spiral. Everything in nature is works in spirals and circles and different formations like that and never in a straight line. Nature likes to have movement and have spirals. And so when we get in connection with nature, then we can start to open up more flow into the areas that are stuck. And those stuck areas are just energy that's not available to us because it's all being blocked there. So we want to get it moving again so it's available to us. So hopefully we can have more health and vitality. So let's take a moment and bring your awareness to your feet. Let them be about wider than the shoulders. And we're going to work with our, start with our left hand going out and our right hand at the hip. And we're going to imagine that we're holding a teacup full of tea here in our, in our left hand. And we're going to take that teacup and we're going to bring it across the body as we shift our weight in the legs over to, to the right. And then we're going to bring our weight back. To, we're going to curl the hand and bring our weight back over to the left. And then we're going to bring our hand up by the head and then over the head and come back into our starting position. So let's do that again. We're going to shift over here to the right and then come back to the left and then come up by the face and then go over the head as we come back. So inhale as we come here, exhale through the nose. Inhale, come up by the face. Exhale as we come back over to our starting side. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. So the legs are pumping back and forth as we do these spirals to open up more movement into the tendons, helping your blood flow a little better, helping the muscles relax a little bit more. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Let's do a few more. Breathing in and out. Breathe in and out. Last one. And up and coming back into our starting position. Good. And then let that hand come to your hip. Let's switch and make sure we help that right shoulder. Good. So let's do the same thing. Let's bring the hand across the body. Shift your weight over here to the left. Curl the hand and then shift your weight back over to the right. And then we'll come up by the head and then back over to our starting position. So shifting left, then right, up by the face and over the head. And the only way to do that over the head is you have to bring your hips forward. So as we do these movements, we're shifting the weight from side to side. And then as you come here, let your hips come forward so that you can get your hand back into the starting position and keep your teacup upright. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Good, two more. Let's do that last one slower so you get a sense of that. Shift, shift back, come up by the head and over the head, come back. So doing your best to kind of keep that, that facing up. Regardless, you're going to get some nice movement. And all this twisting movement is a great way to keep the tendons, muscles, nerves, everything working here much better more energy, not a blocked area. It's an area that allows chi to move. So I hope that helps. Have a wonderful day. Take care.